9th January 2014 is a day still fresh in George Okoth's family. Susan Okoth, the fifth born and only daughter in a family of six siblings, could not be traced. On the fateful day, the elder brother, who happens to be mentally challenged, returned home alone. Her one photo is the only evidence of her existence. Alitoka na mwenzake wakienda kucheza. Hapo karibu na St. John ya Korokocho. Bada ya dakika kama salasini hivi, mama yake kuenda kumuangalia mali walikuwa wanacheza Haka kutana na mwenye walitoka na yeye kama narudi kwa nyumba. Mama haka wapi susi. Uyo kituoto alisema alewacha susi kama nacheza. Nika kasa kutembea ali kariubangi. Nikitembea kumunini, nilikuwa natembea kumuliza watu. Hakuna mtu walimuona. Sasa nilipiga raundi ya di nini? Gorgon. Nilikuwa natembea di sanune usi. Emotions are still high trying to ponder how the then five-year-old charming girl will just go missing mysteriously. Sasa hili kitu ilifanya ni yame ni songe mbali kidogo. Nilikuwa nimechoka na maswali ya majirani. Kwa ni leo umetembea, umepika wapi, susi, ya mjapata ripoti ya yote. Kuyu mtoti na zakuwa lienda wapi. Wengine sasa nae wanasema vitu ya kuniongezea uchungu. Nika sema wacha ni songe mbali, niende ni nyamase. Huko mahali muta yui ni nini litendeka. George, who terms life as empty without his daughter, says there's nothing he has not tried to find his daughter, who is now three months shy of eight years. From one children's home to another, to prophets for God's intervention with no success. Nimetembea kwa mwasipitali, mara ya kwanza ni kwa natembea tampuka kwa mwajari, ya tukuona dalili. Malapu ni kanza na mambo yosipitali, ya tukuona dalili, sasa ya tatu, ni kwa natembea kwa hizi centers, na tunyasikia ripoti yoyote. At one point, the father traveled to Tanzania after getting wind of an alleged woman trafficking children, all in efforts to find Susie who was never to be found. For now, his hope is tied up to a follow-up with the criminal investigative department after someone called using a private number two months ago. He said he was privy of the whereabouts of their daughter and that she was in one of the children's home in Buruburu. His efforts to visit the home were futile after the management told him they did not have such a child. Anyone with any information that could lead to finding Susan Akoth can contact GBS TV or Karyobangi Police Post. Ama anaza wasiliana na child welfare ile iko karibu Hillsdale Airport. Namba yangu ni 0720-500-836. Naomba tu mwenye ako mayeye kusaidie tu. Nearly two years since the mysterious missing of Susan Adhiambo, also Suzy, her family is very optimistic that one day they will be reunited with her. Reporting for GBS News from Lakisama in Nairobi, my name is Cecilia Wakesho.